Hello, and welcome to another solve of the New York Times crossword puzzle. Today is Tuesday, February 28th, 2023. Today's puzzle is by Gia Bosco and edited by Will Schwartz. So let's go ahead and get started. Gen flavoring fruit. Oh, I don't know that one. Um, but it's not coming to mind. I mean, I know you usually have li limes with gin, but I don't know that that is actually flavoring gin. Big gulp. Mm. Fallon's predecessor on The Tonight Show would be Leno. Okay, so it's not lime. Chooses. Opts, maybe. Shared cultural values. Don't know. Uh... Jesus blank, shortest verse in the Bible, Jesus wept. One way, 38 across is offered. Colorful meal in a Dr. Seuss story. Um, so that's going to be green, eggs, and ham. And then we have all of these ways. Uh, another way, 38 across is offered. Another way, 38 across is offered, and so on. Um, so in a box with a box or in a, in a box with a fox on a train in the rain, I think, um, maybe that's this one in the rain. <clears throat> I think that's one. having two young children helps, uh, with that, uh, swig is a big gulp. Oh, and then gen flavoring fruit would be slow. That's a, uh, I think it's a berry of some kind, maybe. Uh, not sure about that, but I've heard of slow gen fizz, and slow is a fruit that flavors it. Um, shared cultural values, ethos, disband, go solo. If you disband, um, get out of a band, you might go solo. Vogue competitor would be L. A magazine, slovenly sort, slob, maybe? Psychedelic fungus, slangily, shroom, Kuwaiti leader, emir, maybe, utter nonsense. Filch? I don't know. Spy org, CIA, I think. Edinburgh, for one. Scott, I think. Scott, uh, Scotsman. Scottish person, Scotch person, I'm not sure. One of those is right, and one of those might be offensive. Sorry about that. Um, Scott, person from Scotland. Uh, I think that's where we're going there. Uh, Toledo's home, Ohio. Syllables sung in The Farmer in the Dell, hi-ho. And the Lone Ranger's companion, Tonto. Big name in elevators, Otto. Otto, I think, is a elevator manufacturer. Um, photo sharing app, familiar, familiarly. <clears throat> oh, not Otto. Otis. That's what the elevator company is called. Uh, because this is Insta. As in Instagram. Another way 38 across is offered. Um... On a don't know. Like a latte made with non fat fat milk and cafe lingo skinny. <clears throat> um hang around aimlessly. Don't know. Um swallows, for example. Birds. Bird swallow is a type of bird. Uh dirt. Gardening tool, ho, afflict, ale, ah, dirt would be soil, right, and annual Janu January honoree MLK, and Yellowstone herd animal is an elk. We had MLK, I think, with that exact clue, or a very similar clue, um, not very long ago, um, on a... Hmm. 
Hmm. No, that, that one's not coming to mind. I don't know. Abandoned. Forsaken. Hang around aimlessly loiter. Utter nonsense is bilge, I think. Ah! There we are. Bilge. Name that's practically synonymous with synonyms. Roger? I'm not sure. I think that must be Roger, but I don't know if I understand the clue as much. Faith was a holy site in Mecca, Islam. Um, okay, let's go back up here. Flies and roads, forks. Producer of tears in the kitchen, onion, famously makes you tear up when you cut it. Not an original. Re something. It shares a computer key with an exclamation point. One, yes. Mercilessly criticizes. Rips on. Could be. And the K of K pop, Korean. Repro, not an original. Overbearing and unpleasant, say. Snotty. Collect it all. Set. Right. And on a boat. Yes, of course. Um, on a boat with, with a goat, I think. Okay, let's see here. Notorious blank. One time Supreme Court nickname. Okay, so that's RBG. Um, make a misstep. Err. And service charge, fee. So soccer official informally would be a ref. Coffee or tea would be a brew. Okay, that's all good. I already know her. We met, I think. Uh, swamp dwelling salamander. Something eel. If this is Roger at the end here. Oh, Oh, uh, synonymous with synonyms, R Roger is in Roger's thesaurus, right? And Toodaloo is Tata. -ta. Part of an Abraham Lincoln costume would be a top hat. Disorderly crowds would be mobs, I think. Start of a spell. Abra is in Abracadabra. Calc for many an engineering major. Pre-rec. Cotton swab brand, Q-tip. Got a Q in there without a U. That's um, that's nice. Grub eat eats. Speak with a hoarse voice. Rasp. Opposed to anti. COVID nineteen informally. Rona. Okay. Coronavirus. Uh, sometimes shortened to Rona. Right. Popeye creator LZ. Oh, Seeger. Yeah, that's what it is. Um, might be Cigar, but I think it's I don't know. Uh, but that's uh, the creator of Popeye from um, Chester, Illinois. Not too far down the river here from St. Louis. Uh, another way 38 across is offered with a goat, as I think I mentioned after on a boat. Maybe not. Ooh, I did not need to know that. TMI. I had that one pop up a couple of times also. Barbecue rod would be a spit, the thing you shove through the meat and then rotate over a, a heat source. Watson, who portrayed Hermione Granger, Emma. Um, knucklehead. Wimp? Wimp? No, probably not. I don't know. Carrie of the Princess Bride, El Elwes. I don't know how to pronounce that, but that's what the name is. Woes. Not sure. This is probably simp, I guess. Um, okay, let's see. Huge favor. Make possible one who won't take no for an answer regarding 38 across. Sam I am, I think. I am Sam, Sam I am. Uh, attacks from all sides besets. Um, another way 38 across is offered. Uh, on a, in a, in a tree, I think. That's one. I think that's right. Huge favor. Is that a big ask? That could be neat and tidy. 
Ooh, maybe not. Like the dragon at the end of a hero's tale slain. Endure. Uh, not sure. Leg in old slang. Gam. Make possible. Enable. Endure. Abide. If you abide something, you endure it. Guacamole for one. Dip. Right. Neat and tidy. Kempt, I suppose. The opposite of unkempt. Which we really think is how you usually hear the word. Dietary, vitamin, or mineral would be a nutrient. Um, woes. Ills, I guess. That makes sense. Yeah. And... Ford flop of the 1950s would be an Edsel, so mud eel. All right, not too bad, just over 10 minutes there and had to, was sort of talking through some stuff and got sidetracked on the whole Scott uh, nomenclature there. Um, yeah, that's clever. I like the, uh, really like the theme there, green eggs and ham fitting across the grid nicely and then um, and then sort of peppering the rest of the puzzle with lots of clues related uh, to that four of the rhyming um, ways that green eggs and ham, would, would you like them in the rain? Uh, I guess it would have been nice. You have on a boat with a goat, which rhyme, it would have been nice had in the rain or, uh had its corresponding clue or in a tree um i don't remember what those are off the top of my head but in, a, in the rain on a train i think and in a tree mm, i'm not sure what that one is been a while since we read it uh anyway and then sam i am as a as a sort of bonus down theme clue is nice very nice touch um right and you know, Phil, Phil, I thought was pretty good too. We had, um, I mean, we had a few things pop up that we'd had before, but, or recently rather. Um, but you know, uh, go solo is nice. Otis, the elevators, uh, elevator company is nice. Um, the, uh, let's see, what else did we have here? Oh, this, the Saurus clue. That was great. Um, name that's practically synonymous with synonyms. Roger's thesaurus. Um, very good. And, uh, oh, and then, as I said, uh, working a Q, um, a Q in without its corresponding U is, um, always sort of a fun little Easter egg. So anyway, yeah, really enjoyed that one. Hope you did as well. And, uh, thanks for watching. See you next time.